My next guest tonight starred in The O.C. and now has a new show on Crackle called Startup. Please welcome Adam Brody. Yeah. <laughs> Did you want to read the script for the interview we're about to do yes, right now? Yes, I do. I've memorized all my lines. Mm -hmm. I'll go with it. Okay, good. Just lead me and I'll follow. Um, uh, nice to meet you. Thanks for being on here. Thank you so much for having now, me. Uh, I understand you were the victim of a crime on your way to do this show. Fashion, fashion disaster. I left my suit on the plane. Left it or I it left was it, so stolen. it was not a crime. Well, to be determined. Maybe never. It but was described I... to me that this was a theft. It's, it's slowly become the stuff of legend in the last 12 hours, which is so silly because it's a So did you steal this? In, in no, but sense? I think I borrowed it from um, the good people at Armani. They're very nice. When, nice. when a fashion disaster strikes... Can you strikes, introduce me? I want to borrow um, something from yeah, Armani. Yeah, well, what kind is that? I'm sure, I'm what sure is you're this? doing okay. What is this? This it is, like this a is Gucci. Gucci. Yeah, not too, not too shabby. <laughs> Not too bad. Um, Gucci Armani. Yeah. Ciao, I left, stupidly, bella. I left it on the plane. I turned around right when I got to baggage claim because I left it, you know, I had them hang it for me. And, um, as you do. As, well, I didn't, I didn't. I just took a carry-on and a suit. That I didn't want to fold it up. You flew the... here in first class, my friend. Sure. Because back in coach, they say, would you like us to compost yeah, that yeah. for you? <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I, I asked, and they said I wasn't there. And uh, what are you going to do? Now I have a bone to pick with you. On okay, the OC, okay, your character, Seth, was described... <laughs> Uh, was Thank couldn't you. get a girl described as something of a dork. Okay, um, that that's that's him. Couldn't get a girl. Okay, <laughs> high school kid. Couldn't get a girl. In fairness, it's pretty. He's pretty dorky still. So. It's pretty dorky. No, this is <laughs> me in high school. That's dorky. Okay, that... I'm sorry. You know, <laughs> this is put on the braces, take off the makeup. That is very much the Fox Television version of you. In exactly. This is who you're playing. On the OC, were you actually uh, were you actually a dork when you were in high school? Not not really, but I wasn't very cool either. My my high school was actually um, it was so mellow. I was one of the first graduating class that started as a freshman, so it was pretty new. It felt like it was a perfectly pleasant place, but it felt sort of more like community college. I don't really remember there being a social hierarchy at all. So. Um, I was with, you know, my group. We did our if own thing. If you don't remember there being a social hierarchy, oh, well, okay. that means you're... <laughs> that means... Yeah. No, everyone... That's like, that's like a lion. That's like a lion going, I don't remember any predators <laughs> in the jungle. Did anybody... Anybody get eaten? I don't remember anybody getting well, eaten. Well, I don't remember who was prom king or anything like that. Okay. But but it I wasn't you. It wasn't you. It certainly wasn't me, although I was talking to a buddy two days ago, who we were freshman water polo players. That's the only year I played. Before... You had a water polo team? <laughs> and and uh, before, it was very embarrassing because it was, I, I did, wasn't in puberty, hadn't gone through puberty when I was, in, uh, when I was a freshman. And um, he recalled getting hung by a Speedo, him and another kid, and uh, uh, I wasn't, I wasn't one of those kids. But, so there was, I guess there was seniors hanging kids by their speedos and not you and not me okay I mean, I'm right i made it out okay uh you were a surfer right correct correct okay do you not do you still surf i do i do yeah yeah i just um i hurt myself recently about six weeks ago hurt my knee. thank you for yeah. you kind of how a, did that happen uh i was just kind of kind of a ah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> i don't I, you know know I, mean? I don't speak the lingo, my friend. <laughs> no, I, I just, I landed on it, right? Okay. Just, you know, yeah. Are you afraid of sharks or anything? Because especially, is this in California you're surfing? Yes. Aren't you afraid on the shark, I'm like on the shark mat there is what I call the surfboard. When your arms and your legs yeah, are yeah, off, yeah, yeah. you just look like a giant juicy seal. It's, Aren't you afraid of that? I grew up surfing and never even thought about it, never saw a shark. I, I stopped surfing more or less, less for a decade, more or less my 20s. Mm -hmm. And um, when I got back in the water infrequently, then all of a sudden I had this, it's sort of an, I mean, it's rational, but statistically it's irrational. Mm -hmm. and, um, and then I do have a little bit, I put my feet up sometimes on the board when yeah. I'm waiting. Yeah. But it's silly. There's, I mean, you know, there are many more things to be scared of. Exactly. Than sharks. Exactly. And this will But what a horrible no way, way to die. What a horrible way to it die. It would be a horrible way to die. And I certainly hope no one plays this footage later of you. <laughs> I, 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 for a laugh. For, it would be fun. It would be funny. It would be really You've funny. You've got my... Uh, <laughs> My consent. 
Entertainment Tonight would play this footage, and then they'd play. Ba -da 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 you know what I don't really like? I don't like. I saw. I won't say who died today, but now in all the headlines, they always go so and so dead. Like, I, I, what happened? Like, dies at 80. They just say they're like stamped dead on everyone's, on the news now. I don't. I don't like it. I don't like it either. Gene Wilder is who I'm referring to. But. Oh, that's so, so sad. He was a wonderful comedic actor and a wonderful man, evidently. Yeah. yeah. And as far as I know, as far as I know, no sharks involved. <laughs> well, Adam, thank, thank you so you much so for much. being here. Thank you. Adam Brody, Startup, premieres September 6th on Crackle. We'll be right back with a performance by St. Paul of the Broken Bone.